What's happening, fam? LAR movement still moving. A little tired, so you know. The book entitled Lessons from a Non Custodial Father, Amazon Kindle Create Space. Do. Does the on point black man want marriage? So. Yes and no. Um, there are brothers out here who want marriage, who got it together. And they may want it for different reasons. I'm going to just name some. Um, some uh, want the quote unquote love and companionship of marriage. You know, I think both men want companionship. Um, some of the men want the obligation and responsibility of a wife in a family. That might uh, increase their productivity and work ethic and reason that to, to build a legacy. You know, there are some who want what their parents had or what they, with other family members who were married who they wanted to be like had or have. You know, some want their best friend to be their wife. You, you feel me? Um, and, and some have positive experiences, and this is the direction they're going, and some of them have negative experiences. And they still want these things in spite of. You have the men who just really want to, in some romantic way, take this lifetime to share it with a person that they feel they love. And they know all of the trappings and the things that can happen that are that won't end well but they don't necessarily care because they feel like they're better equipped to handle vetting people than other people who had bad experiences some are right some are wrong um some want to want their kids to, to grow up in a family atmosphere. You know, for them to, to, to see the normalcy of a two-parent household and a loving uh, wife and husband, man and woman. You know, some don't see marriage as, as a business. Some see it as an actual um, vow before God. Now... There are brothers who see it the opposite way. Um, because there's a lot of negative connotation with, you know, wanting to be married is, is borderline simping nowadays. And there are no, you can't think of you can think of way more negative, adverse effects of marriage for men than you can positives. And there is no, there's a support system for screwing a guy over. And there's not a support system for, for, for being um, fair with him. So some brothers who got their stuff together don't want to, you know, lose all they built because somebody has a, a change of attitude or a change of heart, you know. Some, some brothers don't want to get married because they don't believe that these women have their best interest to begin with. You know, we're, we're kind of at a, at a space where um, love is a weapon and it can be used to destroy a person and nobody and sometimes the best way to win is to not play the game so you don't involve yourself in the game and it's it, in general 
and you save yourself from all of the um, the pitfalls that occur if you involve yourself and lose. And, you know, I think on top of that, it's deeper than sex because, you know, some brothers feel like, I mean, all women are offering the sex to a degree that a woman will tell you that she's more than just her body. And, but in the next sentence tell you, you ask her what she's bringing to the table, she tell you her, she's giving you her body. So there's no incentive to just have a body, which at the end of the day, I think the root cause of all of this other stuff as far as even bad relationships, divorce, child support, breaking up a family to the, to the brothers who don't want who don't want marriage ends with this particular part of it where nowadays women feel like we, we need to pay them for their time. And if they have spend time with us we're always on the we're on the clock. And they're not. So guys are cognizant of that and they're like, that's okay. And some women don't like that but you know, for the guys in that position, I understand it. Cause guess what? When people get get break up, most of the women feel like they're old and forget everything they've gotten. So that's my take on it. I'm out.